Let's now get more on Seoul's decision to silence its 11 anti-Pyongyang propaganda loudspeakers as of 12 p.m. Korea time. Our Kim Hyun-bin is standing by at Seoul's Defense Ministry. Hyun-bin, does turning off the speakers mean that the South Korean military will dismantle them as well? Uh, no, Chie. Uh, the military will not be removing the speakers from the border. Experts say the speakers are part of a contingency plan to contain North Korea's future provocations. The agreement was to stop all broadcasts on the border. Neither side mentioned tearing down the speakers in the agreement. Seoul restarted the broadcast for the first time in over a decade earlier this month, found a landmine explosions in the demilitarized zone on August 4th. North Korea's decision to express regret for the incident, a change from its previous stance of denying responsibility, is being interpreted as an admission that was behind the provocations. So, Hyunbin, in light of the agreement, will South Korea also lower its military alert level? Uh, yes, GA, uh, the defense minister says the South Korean military has lowered its highest alert level at noon, uh, soon after North Korea agreed to lift its quasi-state of war. And North Korea said it would uh, remove its troops and heavy artillery from the front lines back to its regular footing. Now, there were uh, concerns that South Korea had been uh, uh, speaking to reporters this morning, excuse me. Uh, Seoul's defense ministry spokesman says South Korea would reduce its alert level according to North Korea's movements. North Korea said it will lift its semi-state of war status as of noon, and we will carefully monitor military movements north of the border. Our military will stay prepared for possible provocations in the meantime. In another, in another development, uh, some of the 50 North Korean submarines that left port on Friday appear to be returning to base. Uh, there were concerns that South Korea has been unable to trace them on radar systems. Seoul says it will continue patrols to prevent North Korean subs from crossing the southern side of the northern limit line, a uh, de facto maritime border. And the defense ministry still remains that any military actions from the north will be countered strongly. Uh, we should also say that South Koreans living close to the DMZ are feeling especially relieved that Seoul and Pyongyang have reached this deal as they have all been able to return home safe and sound. Uh, reporting live from the South Korea's Defense Ministry, this has been Kim Young bin